in just a few minutes, we'll take a sneak peek at our new facility. But before we do that, I'd like to share with you a little bit about Historic Film Row. This is an emerging hub of creativity and is already home to individual artists of Oklahoma, Paramount, OKC, Odd Fab Design Lab, the Dead Center Film Festival, Carpenter Square Theater, and that's just the name. And it's been great getting to know our new neighbors as we prepare to move to Oklahoma City. We look forward to working with them to help Film Row grow and become even more vibrant in the years to come. Well, we promised you a sneak peek of KOSU. Keep in mind, it is still a work in progress, but follow me. Let's go on in and take a look. And we're really excited about this room. This is our, our new reception area. And we're really excited about this particular space because in our current configuration, we don't have such a room. So this is very nice to actually have a receiving area for guests, for people that we're going to be interviewing on the air, uh, for musicians, and it's going to be a great place for people to come in and experience King and I. So that we actually will be able to look through from the reception area into what we're calling Studio One. And this is where our primary broadcast will occur. Uh, our host for both Morning Edition and All Things Considered will originate the local cutaways and newscasts from this room. We'll also do some live music in this room as well. So let's go on and take a look at that next. Keep in mind, still a work in progress. We haven't soundproofed yet. We still have that to do. Um, we still have a lot to do in terms of build out of equipment, etc. Uh, but it is beginning to take take shape now, and there will be a dramatic change over the course of the next couple of months. But this is again the nerve center of what you'll hear on our air. Um, Studio One will uh, be where we originate a lot of our local programming. We're really pleased to have this new broadcast console desk. Um, which will be, when we have interviews, we'll be bringing guests in around this table. This is the news bullpen. It's an open area, um, and it is where our radio journalists will reside uh, to produce their stories. And we're really excited about this space. Uh, back out. Uh, all the rooms in, in the new facility, I'm probably uh, more excited about this one than, than any. It's our public performance space. Uh, in our current studios in Stillwater, we have no place uh, in which we can actually bring uh, the community in to experience uh, storytelling and music. And this space uh, will serve that purpose in, in Oklahoma City. We're calling it the Heartbeat, um, in homage to the name of the building, the Heart Building, and because it's going to be the nerve center of our community engagement focus. And uh, we're really excited about um, uh, the ability to bring people in to engage them in a deeper understanding of what it means to live and work in Oklahoma. Uh, we'll be able to seat about 50 people in here. So that's our sneak peek at the new KOSU in Phil Row. And uh, we're really pleased you're able to spend some time with us today and we're certainly proud of our new facility. Uh, again, some people we want to thank today, the Ethics and Excellence in Journalism Foundation, the Kirkpatrick Foundation. Uh, their support has been instrumental in getting us to this point. Also, Oklahoma State University and President Lawrence Hargis for their support of our vision uh, for KOSU. And it's really a vision that has unfolded over the course of the last five years. We've seen tremendous growth in listeners, contributors, and underwriters to this radio station during that time. And this is a natural next step for us. Uh, the, uh, new studios and offices here in Oklahoma City are, represent the cornerstone of our five-year strategic plan to engage communities in a whole new way. And that engagement centers on creating content through community and community through content through this facility and through everything that we hope to do with listeners just like you. We hope to be here for a long time to come. For all of us at KOSU, I'm Kelly Burley. We certainly do thank you for your support and have a great day.